Here is how you can restrict a date of entry in our ODK or COBO toolbox. So our typical XLS form has um, a survey sheet. Uh, it also has a choices sheet uh, and it also has a settings sheet. So in our survey sheet, we have the type of question. Uh, we also have the variable name. We also have the label and we also have the constraint. Uh, this is a constraint. I think uh, you need to check the spelling. This is a constraint. Uh, then we also have, now that we want the numerator to uh, be reminded uh, whenever they enter the wrong date of entry, uh, so we shall include what we call the constraint message. So don't forget the spelling and uh, also these are uh, an underscore here. So uh, the type of question is a date. The variable name, you can give it uh, any name. Uh, the label is date. And this is what will be displayed on the screen. Then on the constraint, we shall apply the formula. Uh, open bracket. Uh, this is a period of full stop. Uh, we will call it uh, greater than sign. Uh, then we have is equals and date. Then we open the bracket. Uh, we shall use the single quotation uh, speech mark. And uh, we have maybe the range. Let's give the range between 2020, uh, 1st of uh, January uh, 2020 to maybe 2023, 1st of January. Uh, so I will uh, close with my uh, closing quotation speech and uh, also the double closing uh, brackets because we opened using the two here. So we shall close using the two. Now, we go to our range here. So the range must be between 2020, 1st of January to 2023, 1st of January. I will simply paste here. And uh, I will, since I use the greater than sign, I now use the less than sign. And then I'll give uh, 2023, 1st of January. In the message, I will simply indicate um, maybe these are wrong date of entry wrong date of entry or you can uh, simply use any other word that uh, or any other message that will be displayed simply now uh, save my form then i will uh, now go to my get or decay dot org stroke xls form to test whether the form is okay so here i'll upload my form then i hit submit then i'll preview in the browser before i deploy it so at uh, this date i have selected um this is a uh, 10th of uh, may it means that it is outside the range so automatically uh, the message here is wrong date of entry but if uh, simply uh maybe select 2021 this is wednesday 6th uh, of october then there is not an error message here displayed it means that uh, my form is okay and it is ready to be uh, to be deployed i mean uh, so you can, for those who want to deploy, uh, to use the ODK, you can download here the X form. Uh, you can simply generate your X form and uh, for the ODK. And uh, that's all. Simple.